Welcome back in the fans. Today we're off to Northampton. Obviously they beat Blackpool on Tuesday night like as we beat Burton. It's going to be a hard game tonight. I think tonight. It's going to be a hard game today, but I think we're going to win 2-1. What about you, Mush? No, I think it's going to be easier than Tuesday. I've got a feeling um I think Northampton have come at us at the start like so they've won I think they've won three of their last four something like that. Yeah. Um beat Blackpool big shot like you say. Now I'm pretty confident today. I think Yengi will get a couple of goals. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go 3-0. Who's on the Wall of Fame today then, Mush? Wall of Fame today? Well, it's quite a difficult one um, because there's not a lot of players linked with Northampton, especially up on the wall. But I have found one. Played over 100 games for Pompey. Uh, had two spells at Northampton. You can see him there in the team photo. So today, it's Steve Bryant. Come on, John. No. Riley. Yeah, good. Come on, Paddy. Hey. Come on, Sean. Will. Go on, Joe. Yengi, getting two goals today. I hope so. Maybe three. Are you starting? I am. Yes, he's starting. I'm here with Tony. What's school going to be today? Well, it's going to be a good 2-1. Yengi's going to get um, get there because Colby's obviously not playing. So let's have a bit of Yengi magic today. I'm here with Lee and L. Score going to be today? Uh, probably 2-2. Two, two. Uh, uh, a draw probably would be a good result for us. You guys have been pretty good form. I know you had a 4-0 loss, but other than that, you're doing pretty well. So I'll take 2-2. Two, two. I think we might edge it 2-1. I'm here with James and Teddy. What's score going to be today? 3-1. I reckon we're going to scrape a 1-0. I reckon Raggett's going to score for us. Header from a corner, maybe. I think Yenki will score and Raggett. I'm here with Philip. What's score going to be today? Sorry? Score going to be today? 2-1 uh, to Northampton. And we're the only League One game today. And as you've just said, we're going to win. But we're going to be top today, aren't we? Of course. Back to where we belong, top of the pile. And obviously, you had a shock win at Blackpool. How good actually are you? Um, do you know what? We've, apart from our 4-0 loss at Derby, I'd say we've actually have been pretty unlucky. We're uh, not the best at getting games over the line, but um, we're, I'd, I'd say now being 13th, that's a pretty pretty accurate description of where, where we should be. Considering we've only just been promoted, I think I think we've hit the ground running. We've got the results where we needed them. And obviously, Colby Bishop's uh, injury from Tuesday night is a main talking point today. Is Yengi, will Yengi step up? Oh, hopefully he's going to step up because we're going to need him to. And obviously you got promoted last season. Um, what's your expectations? Well, they had a good win at Blackpool on Tuesday and uh, they should be in good form and Sam Hoskins hopefully will score another goal. Yeah. And like you just said, obviously Colby Bishop's injury is one of the main talking points today. Will Yengi be the man to step up? He's got all the pedigree. He's coming from a man down under and he scores. What more do you want? With Chris Anyone else apart from Sam Hoskins that we should look out for? Kieran Bowie. Anyone else? Uh, Mark Leonard. And today's per profile is Pompey's ex centre half and fans' favourite, Jack Whatmore. Jack Whatmore, player profile. But before we start, what's your favourite Pompey memory? Oh, promotion. No, I was involved in. That was good. That was good. Other than promotion? Uh, probably my debut here at the club. That was a. Uh, Good one and a proud one. All right, pick a card. Bang in the middle. Bang in the middle. Okay. If you number three, if you weren't a footballer, what would you be? Uh, a builder. Uh, what's your least favourite training exercise? Anything in the gym. I don't like being in a gym. And who are the friendliest away fans you've encountered? Um, Cheltenham. It's quiet down there, so they don't really say much. Cheltenham. And who's the most famous person you've met and who anyone you'd like to meet? Uh, Freddie Flintoff. I met him at a Preston game the other week. Uh, that was quite a good one. And I'd love to meet Mayweather. And could we get Pompey in it? Always. <laughs>
today some great saves on a clean sheet yeah take a clean sheet yeah really pleased um yeah that was a good all-round performance today i thought the lads were really good took their chances um and they scored the early goal in the second half which always uh helps to make things a lot more comfortable yeah and um as you said what what's your thoughts on just the match in general today um yeah i thought you know they were uh, they're a good team because they um I beat Blackpool in the week so must be a good team um and i thought we uh we affected them in a really positive way and um and yeah, no, it's a really uh, tough place to come, especially when it's this cold and um, and the conditions were like they were. But you know, I thought the boys were really good. We are Pompey in it. Pompey in it. Cheers, Will. Top man. Paddy Lane, two goals. My man of the match, and I think everyone's man of the match for today. What a performance? Appreciate it. Yeah, great performance. You know, we've come here. It's great. It was always going to be a tough place to come, but you know, we we got the win, and we're buzzing for all the fans that came in and everyone back home as well. And were you worried at any time um, of? Well, were you worried at any point? 
it was going to get called off because of the weather and the cold. We, we said a few times, to be fair, last night in the hotel, we're thinking it, there's a chance of it, but Northampton done really well to get the game on and, you know, fair play to them. But, you know, we, we knew we'd have to come here and put a professional performance on. And obviously, I bet you thought you were going to be able to take home the match ball today. Oh, no, when I went through, I was thinking oh, I might get my first hat trick, but, you know, it happens in football and, you know, next time I get a chance to do that, I, I want to do it. I agree, at Pompey, innit? Yeah, Pompey, innit? Cheers, Not Paddy. Man. Good to see you. John Messino, our sixth away win, our sixth win away from home now, and a brilliant game today. What's your thoughts? Yeah, yeah, a brilliant game. I thought we controlled it from from start to finish. We saw some really, really good football. Three goals is nice. Always want more. I think we could have done four or five, but uh, very, very happy today. Is there any point in time where you thought the game was going to get called off today? No, I think the Northampton had covered the pitch up until the very last minute and it seemed like it was all right. I did switch on BBC today and uh, the Alfreton game got called off really close to kickoff, so I was a bit worried, but um, no, it seemed it was fine. And did you think Paddy Lane was going to bring home the match ball? I thought he was going to get his hat-trick, yeah. My only criticism of him, he didn't, uh, didn't bag all three, but uh, yeah, please, he got two. And can we get Pompey in it? Pompey in it. Cheers, John. Top man. Cheers, mate. Cheers, guys. And can we get Pompey in it? Yeah, Pompey in it. Cheers. Cheers, man. And can we get Pompey in it? Pompey in it. Pompey in it. Cheers. And can we get Pompey in it? No, I'm a Pompey Dinlow. Cheers, Tony. <laughs> can we get Pompey in it? Uh, up the cobblers. Yeah. Up the cobblers. <laughs> How do you call it? Every every week you get the score right. How? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, who cares? Yeah, who cares? A win, a brilliant win, oh, I must great. say. That is just outstanding. Brilliant game, wasn't it? Okay, oh, okay, amazing. Didn't they? Every player put a shift in today. Oh, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Alex yeah. Robertson, as the song goes, oh. he is just magical on the ball. What a joy to watch. Oh, my it? God. Yeah. It's just, he's just quality. Brilliant day all round, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah, I mean, free soup and free goals. Yeah. Well, well, there was just everything today, including limbs. Limbs? I think I'm too old for limbs. I think I finally <laughs> realised that he, today. He got squashed. Oh, my ah. God, it was, it was mental. I suppose, I mean, for me, I mean, it's like when I used to go when I was a teenager, jumping around the fratting end. Yeah. And to see all them young Pompey really enjoying themselves, yeah. just brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Yeah. But I'm a bit too old for limbs, so I want to go and cut the rows in front next time. Yeah, oh my God, <laughs> I know you got squashed as well. Um, hope you liked today's video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you Monday for Bolton at Home.